If you're pregnant and planning your labor, stop scrolling. As a birth doula, I'm giving my top tips of what to know when giving birth in a hospital. Number one, you should not be forced to stay in bed if you don't have an epidural. And if you do have an epidural, you can still be put in different positions that will be effective for labor progress. Number two, you do not need constant cervical checks. That disrupts the natural process of labor. You can have one in the beginning, one at the end, or none at all. Number three, you do not need to be connected to an IV at all times. You can stay hydrated with your own liquids and only have a IV port if you need it. Number four, you can bring your own gown to labor. You do not have to use the hospital gown if you don't want to. Number five, you do not need to push just because you are 10 centimeters. You can wait until you have the urge to push even with or without an epidural. Number six, you can do intermittent fetal monitoring instead of continuous, having them check it every 20 minutes rather than having the monitors on at all times. If they have wireless monitors, you can also use those as well to be more comfortable. And lastly, it sounds simple, but you're allowed to turn the lights off in your room, mamas. Make sure you make the space as relaxing and calming as possible. Hope these help, and remember to make a birth plan to take to your hospital so they know that these are the preferences you want for your birth.